Ooh, it's given Island Kiel. No, it's given the perfect vacation hair. Oh, actually, it's a 360 wig and it is given versatility, Island Kiel, and all of the above. So if you'd like to see how I install this unit and hear all the deets, keep on watching. So let's get into this unboxing. Today we are working with a wig from Ashimeri Hair and yeah, I'm no stranger to their wigs. And guys, when I tell you the wigs always slay, it does. And they always give you some nice goodies, quite a lot actually that you probably end up needing to install your wigs. And I mean, who does not like free stuff? So yeah, I'm just showing you the bits and bobs that comes in the packaging. They also give you like a leap leaflet of how to wear the unit and as i mentioned this is a 360 unit and this is my first time actually installing a 360 unit is the invisi 360 wig and this is the gorgeous unit i'll be working with today the unit does come pre-plucked pre-bleached and pre-cut as you can see that's how it looks straight out of the box yes ma'am look at that hairline absolutely gorgeous i am actually stunned at how well this looked so let's get into the install but before we do that i'm just gonna go ahead and show you the inside of the wig this is just me comparing the lace um against my skin and this is a 13 by 6 so you get a full 13 by 6 as per usual they are never stingy with their lace so you get two um, comes on the sides one at the bottom and your elastic band that has the anti-slip grip at the back as you can see they've also attached three invisi straps as you can see there um, you basically tighten the straps and this just helps the wig stay in place and it won't move and when i tell you it won't move you will see in a second so you basically pull the strap and you tighten it and it should basically scrunch up so basically it should look like this i'm going to show you in a second it's basically going to scrunch up like that and this will basically secure the wig on your head and you've got on both sides so you scrunch up both straps so into the install i am going with my kiki hair care my staple lace tint i don't use any other lace tint when i tell you it just gives me the perfect blend mate yeah so i go ahead and spray both back and front of the wig uh as this is 360 you would want it to basically match and i go ahead to scrunch up the um the strap and just so it can basically fit my head now i'm going ahead to try out the wig as you can see guys the lace is looking uh, impeccable that lace tint yeah <laughs> my go-to so as you can i'm showing you how basically you can scrunch up and make sure you're gentle with this guys i'm basically just scrunching up making sure it is um tight at the back and let's do this shake test it looks <laughs> quite lazy but yeah <laughs> that's the shake test we have done it's not moving at all let's give it another go yeah okay a bit more energy this time and yeah look at how gorgeous this hairline is looking so this part is very crucial guys um make sure you're taking your time whilst doing this that's why i did not speed up the video so you guys can see how um how slow i was actually going and i was making sure i basically cut very very tiny um or very slow and um because you don't want to end up cutting those straps so yeah make sure you take your time to do this and i'm using my cuticle scissors to cut off the ear tabs just so it can better match my head shape as you can see it should be like this just like that and I will do that for both sides as well. So I take my time to do both, both sides. Thank you. 
so it should look something like this and I'll go ahead and tuck the strap at the back of my nape just so it's not visible once I put my hair up in a bun. So I'm going ahead with my Easy Skin Protector and cleaning off my forehead for any um, residue, oil residue or any dirt and yeah just prep my skin for the products i'll be using to install the unit so i'm using a, the gel the ebon gel and i'll also layer it with the ebon spray i'm currently looking for new products to um, use whilst installing so if you guys have any um suggestions please let me know in the comments down below and yeah so as i mentioned i am layering the products i use the gel first and then go ahead with the spray and this gives me a pretty good hold and i'm basically doing sections as usual i start off with my crown first and then now i'm going in with my rat tail comb pressing down the lace and look at how nice that melted guys yeah and you can't even tell this is transparent lace either like it's just giving oh it's so beautiful so i'm doing the same process um for each sides as well as i mentioned i actually install my units in sections so yeah so once i'm done with the crown i'll go over to my sides nah guys look at this melt this is absolutely gorgeous you can't even tell the other side is not melted or even glued i am absolutely stunned this unit is super super gorgeous so i'm gonna go ahead and do the other side So I went ahead to add some um, lace melting spray um, on the cap and then use my fingers to just press down that product onto the lace. Just make sure your hands are not dirty or oily because that could be a disaster. You can use the edge of the rat tail comb which I usually use but this time around I was just being very lazy so I ended up using my hands. So I'm going in with the melting band from Ashy Mary Hair and leaving that on for a couple of minutes before um, taking it off. So this is just me admiring the hair, looking at the curls or feeling the curls should I say and also testing out seeing if it sheds a lot or not and with curly hair you will experience shedding that's just how it is unfortunately but it did not shed too much so it was just minimum shedding but look at this melt guys y'all can't tell me this is not my hair come on now this is given and i'm feeling puerto rican in this yeah oh god look at that melt i can't lie sometimes i actually do shock myself at how well i install wigs but we well, thank god yeah so now we're gonna go ahead to do some baby hairs because i love doing baby hairs on curly units and yeah that's just how it is i'm going to do some um respectable baby hairs not the ones that i'd be doing too much okay um if that's what you like then baby go ahead and do you um but i'm gonna do minimum baby hairs um 
yeah we're gonna just do some swoops i went in with my pencil straighteners and then sprayed some hairspray onto the baby hair brush and now i'm just trimming the edges making sure it's not too long that's pretty much it nothing really fancy here To make sure this wig is flat, I went in with my Edge Booster pomade stick, applied that at the front of the wig. Obviously, you don't want to apply too much of it as well. So as you can see, I'm being very gentle. And then I'll go in with my hot comb to press down this wig because we want it to be flat, natural and all of the above. can't lie there's just something about a three-part curly unit it just eats every single time look at that melt baby absolutely gorgeous and this texture this water wave texture is 10 out of 10 this is absolutely gorgeous this is just me showing you yeah okay i'm feeling myself there you can tell i could actually cause trouble in this there so went ahead and add the band again because i'm about to define these curls baby i used water and also my custard and smoothie absolutely love that range those products smell so good you can use either or um i was basically testing out the custard first and then i decided to add the smoothie i should have done it the other way around so smoothie first and then custard custard lord um so yeah that's basically what i did so as you can see i'm just um spritzing some water onto the hair first and then go ahead to detangle the unit before going ahead to add the products on when i told you gave my curls the most beautiful curls ever it was so defined okay that was so so horrible anyways it looked really really good absolutely loved it like guys this is just so so beautiful like i can't ash your mary hair you've definitely done it again and you always end up leaving me speechless whenever i install a unit from you guys hands down one of my favorite curly units this is so so stunning and for the fact that i've never ever installed a 360 and it was so simple to install guys yeah definitely check out this unit because it's perfect for, for winter it's perfect for summer definitely summer because then you can put your hair up and it's perfect for the, for those babes that love versatile units you can do so much with this unit and yeah you won't regret it definitely check down below for the link because baby this summer you will be looking like a puerto rican goddess in this unit absolutely stunning love every bit of it okay so this is how it's looking when it's fully wet and defined absolutely stunning love that and you'll see in a second how it looks when it's dried so this is how the hair is looking it is fully dried the curls are defined i went for a free part and look 
at this lace, guys. Look at this lace. Super melted and it's not even HD. This is super stunning. This is absolutely gorgeous. And you can also go ahead and do a middle part if you'd like. Let's see. As you can see, you can also go ahead and do a middle part, but sort of like the free part. Yeah, this is so pretty. Look at how well this blended in. This is super, super stunning. And this texture, this texture is everything. I believe this is Water Wave as well. And yeah, Water Wave is definitely one of my favorite textures, curly textures. Super cute. Right, so as this is a 360, I'm gonna go ahead to put the hair up in a bun. So you guys can see. Let me get a scrunchie, yeah. This hair's just giving. Right, let's put this in a bun. Right, so this is how it is looking whilst up in a updo. This is super cute. This is absolutely cute. I am in love. Like the lace is giving, everything is giving, the curls, everything is giving. Let me show you the back area because, you know, that's why it's a 360 so you can put it up in a bun and do all sorts with it. So let me give you guys a look nah look at how natural this looks when up in an updo absolutely gorgeous like this is absolutely stunning i am in awe with this hairstyle it is so cute i just love how versatile this wig is as well like this is super super cute it is definitely definitely worth the money you can put your hair up in a bun and it ends up looking it still looks good with it being up in a bun so you don't have to stress about it looking crazy so yeah so let me talk you guys through the specs real quick this unit is from ashy mary hair this is their 360 water wave unit it is 26 inches it comes pre-plucked pre-bleached and everything is done for you baby literally all i had to do was put this baby on and literally just cut off the ear tabs and that was it literally also i had to tint the lace obviously because it's a transparent lace did i mention it's a transparent lace yeah you can't even you no okay yes it is a transparent lace but look at this melt it is looking absolutely insane impeccable love it um yeah so I, I think that's pretty much it i'll make sure to leave all the specs and details down below in the description box so make sure to check it out and thanks to ashley mary here for sponsoring this video and thank you guys for clicking on and hanging out with me today if you did find this video helpful please do not forget to give it a thumbs up also do not forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell just so you're notified whenever i make an upload and that is all from me today i'll catch you in my next one bye